We're going tonight to go see it, Regina. Taylor, I was going to link this shirt. This shirt is from Jackson Grace, but it sold out. So, it wouldn't let me link it. I'm sorry, y'all. Um, Charlotte. Charlotte about just pulled my whole setup down. Quit. Summer. Go put Charlotte out. Go put her outside. Charlotte is on my ever-loving nerve, y'all. I swear she knows when I'm in here, like, busy. And then that's when she decides that she wants to act crazy. All right, now I got drinks and stuff up here. Oh, it's her rib. Get her rib. Right there. Go put her outside on the screen porch with that rib. Okay. She's about to drive me to drink. Let me pull my pants up. Oh, good. My mercy. Okay. feel like I'm falling apart over here. So, this shirt is kind of almost like you can button it. You can button it, obviously, and just wear it like this. But I'm kind of trying to do like a cute little off-the-shoulder moment. I don't know if it's really working or not. Um, the Blind is the best movie out now. It's amazing. Okay, good. I can't wait to go see it. I'm serious, y'all. Like, oh, my God. Driving me crazy. Okay, I'm trying to get... We're like the only thing in my background where you can't see where my door's open. Okay, rose water. Those are my favorite energy drinks. Yes, it's either these or the Kim K are my favorite. You cried the whole movie? Oh no, is it going to make me cry? We're going to Jessup to go see it, Nikki. You Derma playing Victoria? How'd it go? Mm. Thank you, Regina. I completely forgot about that. Thank you. I got these from the Sweet Peach Boutique. They're really comfy. Okay. I'm going to do some rose water. Mm. Do some eye cream. I haven't done anything with my face today except cleanse it. Is it sad, y'all? I didn't know it was sad. Thank you, Kennedy. Regina, have you went and seen The Blind yet? It's so smooth. Doesn't it make such a huge difference with your makeup? Oh, yeah. I don't ever go to the theater in Hinesville if I don't have to. I like the one in Jessup because it's so much more low-key. I don't like being around. Like, I don't like... I really don't like going to the movies where there's, like, a ton of people in the movies. Because somebody's always going to be talking and it's just... I want to be able to, like, watch the movie and enjoy it. No, I haven't tried the snail mucin. I have a pretty, like intense skincare routine. So, I don't know if I want to throw the skincare, the snail mucin in on that. You know what I mean? Much more clearer on Facebook. How's my picture on TikTok, y'all? Is it bad? Oh, I'm so sorry to hear about your grandma passing away. You're making my chili? That chili was really good the other night. Um, definitely will be doing the two packets from now on, the two seasoning packets. Okay, let's do some lip mask and lip plumper because, holy moly, our lips feel like, oh, it's like they're sunburnt. Thank you, Caitlin. Thank you for the follow, Sid. Yes, Norma, the glow collection is so good. I've been doing the glow collection in the morning and then my Zoe skincare at night. Nikki, the deals this month are lips. Everything lips is on sale. Hey, Amy. Hey, Kathy. 
Okay, uh, what's next? I'm gonna do some of the super goop glow screen, even though, I mean, it's dark. <laughs> but I just still really like this under my makeup. It's got the glow, and I almost kind of use this as like my moisturizer and my primer, so we're just gonna do it anyways. Hey, Ansley. Thank you, Molly. I appreciate that. What's everybody up to, y'all? What's y'all's Friday night plans? What's my favorite song? Oh, man. Have y'all heard that song, Mamaw's House? By, um, uh, Thomas Rhett and Morgan Wallen. That is really good. Hey there. Dirk, um, had me listen to it. And, okay, it reminded me of two things. Devin called his grandma Mamaw, and she passed away, and it was so sad because Devin really loved her. Um, so, of course, that makes him think of his mammal because mammal's house. But the words actually remind me of my mama. Um, the headband that I'm wearing is from Brianna Cannon, and I have a link and um, code in my bio. You're going to go play bingo for the first time? I love bingo. Hey, Rachel. Hey, Ashley. Hey, Casey. Okay, I'm going to do some of the e.l.f. Halo Glow Liquid Filter in the shade 4. Um, Y'all, I thought they sold NYX at Walmart. I, um... Sorry, I'm burping from that energy drink. It sounded like Charlotte was outside, but she's on the screen porch. Um, I looked in Walmart because I was going to get a shade up in those two brow products that I used yesterday. And they didn't have NYX at Walmart. I could have swore they did. Am I going crazy? Seven Minutes in Heaven by Reba Made You Cry. Is that a new song? I never heard of that. The stand that has my hair tools, that's like a vintage hat hanger. You like Cody Johnson's new song? I can't wait to go see him next weekend. What new song are you talking about? Um, Nikki, what size t-shirt do I wear? So, I'm normally a large, but most of the time for t-shirts, I like like an oversized look. And I do it extra large. Are you guys still doing the t-shirt thing? I'm just going in with this. I don't even know if I told y'all what I'm doing. I'm just doing some of this Serum Plus Foundation from Unique. I'm using the shade Eyelet, and I'm just going to mix it with that Halo Glow. Hey, Amy. The painter. Oh, yeah, I do like that one. So, are any of you guys going to be at the concert next Saturday night in uh, the In Market Arena to see Cody Johnson? I'm so excited. We have not been to a concert since the Jason Aldean, and I think that's where we went and seen Jason Aldean. You and your dad are going to see The Blind tomorrow? I'm just blending this in with my Kabuki brush from Unique. And then we're gonna get everything pressed in with the uh, Beauty Blender. What state am I in? I'm in Southeast Georgia. The concert that we're going to next weekend is in Savannah, which is like an hour from us. You guys seen it last? Yeah, I have heard nobody say that the blind wasn't good. Everybody that has went and seen it said it was good. Sarah, how did you get into social media influence and love your lives and how real and genuine you are? Oh, thank you, Sarah. So, what actually got me into doing this is um, when COVID hit, I started promoting Unique. And I got quarantined at home with my kids during COVID. And I got super bored. And one day I just decided to hop on live and do my makeup. And here I am. <laughs> you expected a little more? Do I like Nashville? Did you mean Nashville? I finally got me a building waiting to get it wired for power. Um... Everything set up to people for Iver. Oh, okay. That's understandable. Saw it at the Strand. Can't beat those reclining seats. That's exactly where we're going. What did I do before social media? I worked at a bank. Most of my um, 
working career is in banking. Hey, Jenna. Um, I did go to beauty school, and I do have my master in co cosmetology. I did that for a minute, not long. Uh, yeah, I like Taylor Swift. Thank you, Christy. And I told Devin, I said, I wouldn't mind going to see a Taylor Swift concert. He was like, <laughs> Dirk would probably go with me to that too, because Dirk really likes Taylor Swift. I've never thought Taylor Swift was like a really strong vocalist, but I've always liked her music. And she was, Taylor Swift is nostalgic for me because she came out when I was in high school. So, that song, Tim McGraw, I still love that song. Thank you, Adriana. Adriana, I hope I said your name right. Um, I did like cosmetology school, but I did not like being a hairdresser. Not my thing at all. I've always liked makeup more than hair. I'm just coming in with some Skin Solution Concealer from Unique in the shade Scarlet. Um, hey, girl. Hope your Friday is going well. It is Elizabeth. Shelby, I didn't get your message. I got my strand tickets for $900. i am not looking forward. I can't wait to go see the blind, y'all. I seen where Taylor Swift is going to have her concert, like, in the movie theater. I've never done that before. I've never went to the theater to see. Y'all know that's going to be the new world. Like, the concerts are going to be a thing of the past. Everything is going to be virtual at some point. Ain't that kind of scary to think about? My sister went to cosmetology school and she said the same thing. Yes. I just, school was fun and I met a lot of friends in cosmetology school, but... Working in a hair salon was not my vibe at all. And I tried working in Ulta. That was absolutely terrible. Like, I would never recommend anybody to work at Ulta. <laughs> you couldn't have your phone. Like, me being a mama, the thought of me not having access to my phone really freaks me out. And you had to bring, you couldn't bring in like a regular purse. You had to have like a clear bag and they have, like, clear lockers that you put your purse in, which I'm sure because people steal things. But it was just like you were a prisoner. I don't know. Like, I, that was probably up there at one of the worst jobs I've ever had. They just announced she made $4 billion just from her tour. I bet she did because I heard her tickets were kind of expensive. Yeah, I sure did. Have I ever done somebody's makeup for their wedding? Yes. Um, I did my nephew's wife's makeup. And it's so funny because we're sitting here talking about Taylor Swift and she's definitely a Swifty. Like the whole time, um, me, the whole time I got her ready, like in her little setup for the wedding, we listened to Taylor Swift the whole entire time. Like she's obsessed with Taylor Swift. Happy Friday. So, I guess I'm just going to use those same product, uh, brow products as yesterday. And for some reason, I'm kind of wanting to do a half lash. I haven't wore fake lashes in a minute. And, like, this part of my lash is really long. And I don't feel like I need it right there. But I feel like I could use some volume and length on the outside. I'm in the process of trying to get my outside to grow. I feel like the inside of my eyelashes are long. It's just the outside. But it could be like the shape of my eye. My eyes are so round. Hey, Holly. Hey, Marlene. Hey, Melissa. I loved your brows yesterday. Oh, thank you, Regina. That was the Skin Solution Concealer from Unique in the shade Scarlet. If you want to be shade match, just let me know. Thank you, Alyssa. Okay, I think I got everything good and pressed in. Ooh, I didn't dermaplane very good. I missed a bunch of spots. Okay, I'm just going to set with the Huda Beauty um, setting powder in the shade Cupcake. You were going to message me last night and you forgot. What's up? 
use unique Hey, Jackie. Okay, I'm just going to set with my tapered blusher brush from Unique. I love this setting powder. I promise y'all it is the best. So, so good. I go back and forth between this shade and the Cherry Blossom Cake. Look at the difference that that makes. Is that not insane? Hey, Katie. Um, so the blind is telling the story of y'all. If you guys have seen it, correct me if I'm wrong. Isn't it telling the story of um, Phil and Kay from Duck Dynasty? I believe it's like telling their story of like their love story and how they got started making the um, duck calls. Everybody I've talked to said it's so good. Oh, really? I've never heard of that lash serum. That's what it's about, Brandy. That's what I thought. Thank you, Marlene. Okay, yeah. Everybody keeps talking about how good it is, and it's still in theater, so I'm like, it must be good. I love Duck Dynasty. I've seen every episode of Duck Dynasty way too many times to count. It's like one of those shows that I could just keep watching over and over, like Friends. It's like a good comfort show. And you can watch it around your kids, you know? It made you cry. Yes. Yeah, that was crazy how he found out he had a daughter. I was not expecting that. Is that like in the movie too? Hey, Kenzie. What happened to their show? I think they just, I mean, they had a pretty good bit of seasons. I don't think they make it anymore, do they? I haven't watched that in forever. When Luke Got Married was your favorite? Wait, who has a daughter? Um, Phil. Remember he had a daughter that he didn't know about? The daddy. Phil's my favorite. Phil's the funniest. Phil and Sa. Thank you, Lisa. Do you know Shelby the Swamp Man? I don't think so. I'm from uh, Southeast Georgia. Okay, so I've never listened to Sadie's podcast, but... Um, if you follow Nicole Huntsman, she does like a, um, what is it called? Like a Bible study, I guess, for women every day. And she follows Sadie Robertson's uh, book. Okay, I'm just doing some of the Unique Pressed Powder Foundation in the shade Taffeta. I'm going to set the rest of my face with that. Yeah, Mia, it's like a new, that's a new thing that came out that Phil had a daughter that he didn't know about. And I think that's what this movie is about. I think it's kind of based around that. Him, like, telling his story that, you know, he wasn't always a godly man. You must be invisible. I didn't see your comment. It probably filtered it out. Dirt loves his truck. I didn't even see what he said. We are going to the movies to go see The Blind. Amber, so that's one thing that I actually like about that dry shampoo is it gives your hair a little bit of texture. So that's kind of like the purpose of that, of the deja vu, is not only is it a dry shampoo, but it also gives your hair like some texture. I love that. But if you don't like it, then definitely... Don't use it. You like Jace? Yeah, he's funny. Um, Do I sneak snacks into the movies? I used to. But now I don't because I don't really carry a big enough purse like I used to. But yeah, I used to. I haven't done that in a while. Um, no, not necessarily a date night. We're taking the kids. 
Dirt doesn't want to go, but I'm thinking about trying to bribe him to get him to go. If you have fine hair, yeah, you definitely don't need a lot. That's for sure. So, yeah, you may have put too much. And, like, you don't need to be, like, really close. You know what I mean? Kind of, like, stand back to spray it or, like, hold the bottle back. You don't need to, like, So, that could make it, like, overly, um, that can overdo it, too, is what I'm trying to say. My necklaces are getting all wonky. Um, we used to get a big old Ziploc bag. Yeah, girl. I know some people that have, like, smuggled a whole pizza <laughs> in a theater. I'm like, how the hell? They just took their blanket and, like, put over it. I'm like, okay, now that's bold. My headband is from Brianna Cannon. I have a link and discount code in my bio. My necklace, this necklace is from the Sweet Peach Boutique. I just shared it yesterday and tagged them with my discount code and these earrings. But my necklace is from the Sis Kiss Boutique. Um, hey, Madison. Hey, Kimberly. Okay, I'm going to do some of the unique matte bronzer in the shade medium. And I'm going to mix it with the highlighter in the shade bronzed. And get my face bronzed up. Um, let's see. Yeah, that's how it is too, Regina. The one that we go to in Jessup, it has like the reclining sleet, sleets. It has the recline. Why can I not say it? It has the reclining seats and you order from like where you're sitting. And I really like that. It's a dinner theater. That's why we always go there. They have really good pizza. They have, um, uh, like burgers, um, fries. I'm trying to remember what else. Like all the usual, like candy, popcorn, but they have like actual food. It's a dinner theater. Yeah, it has. It is expensive though. It is pricey. Especially, like, when we go with the kids. Because, you know, they gonna get drinks. And Summer wants candy and popcorn. Dirk wants pizza. But, it's worth it to us. Like, we really enjoy it. Your mother-in-law lived in Jessup. Now she's in Odom. Girl, my mom and daddy didn't even take us to the movies. <laughs> if I went to the movies, most of the time, like, we would go to, like, the drive-in, and, like, my, one of my older sisters would take us. I don't ever remember not one time my mom and daddy taking me to the movies, but they just didn't go. But my mom and daddy couldn't afford all that. You know, they were just trying to work and pay bills and, like, keep us fed. <laughs> the hell with the movies. But my daddy did always take us, um... Like, Daddy would always take us fishing. We would always go hunting. You know, we would do things that didn't cost an arm and a leg. <laughs> yes, very much worth it. Yeah. And um, the beach, too. My mom and Daddy never took us to the beach. But Daddy did take us to the river. And he would, um like, let us get on the sandbar and stuff. So, that was, like, the beach to us. Hey, Tessa, you're going to go see the new Saul movie? Those, I cannot handle those movies. I love a scary movie, and I thought long and hard about going to see The Exorcist, but I've really been wanting to see The Blind, and we're going to have Summer with us, so. We let Summer watch um, the Nun movie, but I don't know. I don't think she needs to see The Exorcist, but I've been wanting to see The Blind anyway, so we're going to do that instead. Thank you, Marie. Okay, and I'm just going to take my eyeshadow blending brush, and I'm going to do my nose with that same bronzer. Yeah, everybody keeps talking about how good it is. Okay, The Old Exorcist, I will never forget watching that for the first time. That is by far one of the most scariest movies I ever remember watching as a kid. The only thing that topped The Exorcist for me was it. It actually, like, scarred me as a kid. And I'm not even joking. Like, to this day, I cannot stand clowns. Me and Devin went to that Spirit Halloween store. And, you know, they have, like, those animatronic, as I say it, um, spooky things. 
and you know, a lot of them were clowns. And there was this one you stepped on him, and his like head started spinning like all the way around, and he was huge. He was so scary. Yeah, I like scary movies, but I don't like Saw because it's so gory. I'm not real big on, like, gory movies. Like, I don't want to see people getting all, you know, I don't want to say too much and then get nannered, but you guys know what I mean. You don't like scary movies? My favorite scary movie, I want you guys to comment your favorite Halloween or scary movie because... I'm always up for watching a good Halloween spooky movie. But my favorite one is probably... Um, my favorite Halloween movie is probably Practical Magic and Hocus Pocus. I really love those two. But like, scary movie, my favorite one would probably be... Jeepers Creepers really creep me out. Like, seriously. Um... I used to watch, like, older scary movies. We used to watch Chucky. We used to watch, and I was little watching these movies, and I go back and watch them, and I'm like, oh, my God. I was way too young, but I also had three older siblings, so I didn't have a chance. I'm doing blush in the shade Supple and Sweet from Unique. Wrong turn. That one was really creepy. Amityville Horror, uh, that wasn't never one of my favorites. Um, Cold Creek Manor was good. I liked Cold Creek Manor better than Amityville Horror, and I felt like they were kind of trying to mimic that movie. Oh, Pet Cemetery was another one that scarred me as a kid. Anything that Stephen King ever come out with was like super, super scary. Yeah, the hill, the hills have eyes. Oh my gosh, Freddy Krueger. Yes. I will never forget, um, my sister had a Chucky poster, and it was of Chuck, like, in her room, and it was Chucky, and it was the poster, I guess it was, like, maybe the cover of one of the movies, and it was, like, a Jack in the Box, and he had the scissors, like, on the Jack in, Bo Jack in the Box, and that will forever be ingrained in my head, because I was so scared of that poster, I would walk in, I'm like... <laughs> Yeah, Pet Cemetery was scary. I haven't watched the Sinister movies. Yeah, the Scream movie is really good. And Scream is very nostalgic for me because that's like my generation. Dead Silence. Yeah, I think I have seen that one. Ain't that the one about the puppets? That one was really scary if that's the one about the puppets. That was like, yes, up there is one of the most scariest ones I've ever seen. That lady was creepy. Especially um, when it goes back to him as a little boy and she like falls out of her casket. Oh my gosh. So scary. Silver Bullet is, um, Silver Bullet was always my sister's uh, favorite scary movie because I remember hearing her talk about it. Yes, that one, The Exorcism of Emily Rose was very scary, Jackie. I do remember that one. When she wakes up and she's like on the floor all like bent backwards and stuff. I had never seen Don't Breathe. Do I need to watch that? Um, I would love to see Louisiana. I've never been to Louisiana. I'm going to use two shades of highlighter from Unique. I'm going to do the shade Frosty and the shade Blushing. It's creepy. Yeah, I like all the Disney Halloween movies, too. So, I like, like, Disney Halloween movies, and then I also like, you know, real scary movies. As long as they're not, like, super gory. My earrings are from the Sweet Peach Boutique. Yes, I would love to go to Louisiana. Me and Mama were talking about going to New Orleans because she's been before with the VFW. And she said they had the best time. Like, they really enjoyed going to New Orleans. I would love to see it. And I would love to go with my Mama because she's been before. So, I would be comfortable going with her. So, maybe we can do that one day. 
Yes, I love the faculty. Me and Devin actually watched that the other day. The faculty is another one that's nostalgic for me because that's like my generation. It's so good. I still enjoy watching it. No, I don't wear colored contacts. Thank you, Amber. You're from Houston? Yeah, I'd love to see Texas too. I love these energy drinks and they really help me get my work done and give me all the mama energy, but man, they make me burp so bad. And I need to go talk to Devin because I think the movie starts like 8.45, but we're definitely going to have to eat before then. Like, I am hungry. We, Me and Devin ate lunch at 11. I feel like I'm about to starve right now. What are you guys eating for supper? I need a idea of something good. I'm going to do the Unique Touch Behold Prime and Set Mist. Go ahead and set my face. Oh, I love Halloween Town. Cooking pork chops. Girl, I ain't cooking nothing tonight. Nothing. Um, okay. Uh, we're going to, like I said, we're going to do that same brow routine that we did yesterday. Even though the color's a little off, but... I could probably make it work again. I'm just going to do this NYX Thick It Stick It. This Thickening Brow Mascara. I actually really like this stuff. I just wish I had more brows. Like, this would work really good if I had more brows. Chicken fried steak. That sounds really good. I'm using the shade Auburn. I went to go get Brunette today. But they didn't have NYX. They didn't have... Is it NYX or NYX? They didn't have this in Walmart, which was, I was really shocked because I could have swore that they had NYX in Walmart. So, I don't know if I just dreamed that. I don't know, but I was super disappointed. Um, We don't have an Outback Steakhouse here. We have a Longhorn, but we're going to Jessup. So, it's kind of limited. Um, Jessup has a Taco Bell. Zaxby's. They have a really good Mexican restaurant, but we went there last night with Devin's parents and his aunt and uncle from Tennessee because they were leaving today. So, definitely don't want Mexican. Um, I don't know where we're going to eat, actually. There's a good pizza place over there called Gooey's, but I don't think I really want pizza. I'm not in the mood for pizza. Yeah, we love Texas Roadhouse. <laughs> Okay, and then for my uh, other part, of, like to make more brows, because obviously I have none, I'm going to do the NYX Lift and Snatch Brow Tint Pen. This is the shade Blonde. This is the one that I really wish I would have got Brunette in. Like, I feel like this is way too light. The chili was really good. I do really like this pen, though. I think it definitely makes... Um, natural brush strokes. So, I just do it kind of like messy, but then I just go in with concealer and clean it up. Did y'all get it? Yeah, see, this is way too light. It's lighter than my brows. I got the blonde because I was scared that the brunette was going to be way too dark. And I definitely underestimated. Dirt? Yeah. Are y'all done? No. Nah. What are y'all doing? Telling you to get me something to eat. Yeah, I, we're going to go get something to eat. Well, I get we're going to go eat. Do you want to go with this? Okay, this is going to look really crazy. I promise it'll be better when I clean it up with a uh, concealer. So, don't like... Don't count me out just yet. But I really, really like this pen. It's just not dark enough. So... What's your daddy doing? We're just, uh, 
Just get something small because we're going to go get something to eat before we go to the movies. What are you going to eat then? There's a pizza in the okay. You didn't want to go with us? No. Really? It's so messed up. Like I said, it's going to look really crazy. I promise, y'all. I'm going <laughs> to fix it. Trust the process. I'm from Southeast Georgia. More cleaning videos. Okay, and then I'm just going to take that same concealer that I used to brighten my T-zone with my cream shadow brush from Unique, and I'm going to clean them up. Hey, April. Hey, Lisa. Hey, Ashley. Dirk's such a little turd. I knew he wasn't going to go to the movies with us. He makes me mad. Oh, the Strand be sh Yeah, I forgot. That's right there by it, too. That's where we need to go. And, yes, we do like sushi. We like, I mean, we like, like, California rolls and stuff. We ain't no, like, sushi connoisseurs or nothing like that. But we do like California rolls. Okay, I'm trying to, like... I absolutely cannot do my brows without concealer. Like, if I didn't have concealer, I don't know what I would do. It's the only thing that somewhat makes me look like I know what I'm doing. Because... These brows be looking cray-cray. But look at the difference that makes. Is that not crazy? Just Googled best places in Jessup. <laughs> yeah. I, I forgot about the the restaurant that's right there by the... And it, I think it's the same people that own the... Um, hey, Lisa. I think it's the same people that own the Strand. I'm pretty sure. Oh, thank you, Molly. Hey, Ava. Hey, Addie. Oh, and Summer has her very... Tomorrow is going to be a very hectic day for us. Um, tomorrow is Summer's very first uh, football game. It's her very first game that she's going to cheer at. Very first game she's cheering for. Um... And that, we have to be there at 8.15 in the morning. So, pray for me. Because I don't even like waking up early on school days. Much less on Saturday morning. So, we're all going to be exhausted. And then tomorrow is also Dirk's birthday party. And we're doing a low country bull. So, we're just going to be like... Tomorrow's going to be super busy and hectic. But in like a good way. Like, I'm excited. So, if I do a get ready with me, it's going to be very early in the morning. Like, probably 6.30. Because I'm also going to have to curl her hair. Those aren't too bad. I think if I could just get that brunette pin, I think I would be a lot happier with these. I think the only thing that's throwing me off is the the pen's not quite dark enough. Happy birthday, Ava. Mm -hmm. um, that was concealer that I just used to clean up my brows. And then I'm also going to do some of this 24-hour brow setter from Benefit. I'm also going to put that in my brows. Which, the Thick It Stick It, honestly, it does hold my brows good, but I just feel like I need to kind of, like, fluff them up after I get done with the concealer. Yes, I got new brow stuff to try, the NYX. You're taking your grandbabies to the pumpkin patch?
I miss going to the pumpkin patch so much. Um, we're just going to do a normal, regular eye look. I don't feel like doing anything. You need a good foundation? Angela, message me. I can shade match you. I'm trying to think which lashes I'm going to do. I might do these and just cut them in half. I just want like a little old baby half lash. Nothing crazy. I think I need to throw these things away. These lashes look rusty crusty. These things have been in here for a hot minute. Yeah. That is probably not. But these I don't think I ever wear because they're like way too long. I thought I had some other lashes in here. I guess I don't. I must have got rid of them. Okay, I'm going to do the Unique Mood Truck Addiction Palette Number 10. And I'm just going to use these brown shades. We're just going to do a brown smoky eye. Hey, Haley. Hey, Caroline. Hey, Kelly. I'm just going to start with this brown shade first. And just start adding some dimension. I don't even remember the last time I've done like a half lash or anything like that on my eyes. I've just been doing mascara. And the mascara I use helps my lashes grow. So, we're definitely going to be doing that. Because I've been trying to be really consistent with that so that my lashes will grow. You sent me a DM on TikTok? Yep, I will check it as soon as I get out of here. I mean, as soon as I get off of here. Um, what do you have to do to get shade match? Um, you would just need to message me on my Instagram or my Facebook. That's linked in my bio. Because I'm going to need you to send me a picture of natural light. No filter. I need to be able to see your neck and your chest. Because I actually shade match people based on their neck. Not their face. Because, you know, your foundation needs to match your neck. So, that's how I how I do that. I have to be able to see your undertone. That's why I need it in natural light. So the lighting is really important. Okay, just make sure it's good and diffused and dragged outward so it's not too harsh my facebook is linked in my bio and so is my instagram who the maker of the match makeup mm, what do you mean judy hey chloe hey lacy hey tabitha hey maddie okay and then i'm just gonna take this fluffy crease brush this one and i'm gonna go into that darker i'm gonna mix these two the lighter brown and the darker brown. And I'm just going to add a little bit of depth on the outside of my eyes, like right here. I like using this brush to do it because it kind of like feathers it on there and it doesn't make it like a blunt, a blunt spot of that eyeshadow. It just kind of like, it makes it look more blended, like seamless. Which is what we want. And we don't want to have to sit here and do a ton of blending. No, thank you. Nobody's trying to do that. I'm not trying to do that. So, praise you if you are. Because I can't stand sitting there forever and blending eyeshadow. I ain't got time for that. Or the patience. Julian, um, we are getting ready to go. I'm just going to take my crease brush. What is this? Yeah, crease brush from Unique. It's like a little pencil brush. And I'm going to go into that lighter brown and smoke out my under eye. We are getting ready to go watch The Blind. We've been wanting to go see it and just haven't had a chance. So, we're finally going to go tonight. i got to take this headband off. It's, ooh, give me a headache. Thank you. The name of the makeup, this is Unique. I 
I use some things from other places, but um, the majority of my makeup is unique. And I just kind of like blend that in right there on the outside. And then I'm going to take my deluxe brush, which is, which is kind of like a flat, softer brush. Yeah, everybody's been talking about how good it was, y'all. I can't wait to go see it. And I'm going to take that cream shade right there and put that on my um, uh, lid. Thank you, Laura. I don't need makeup. I want makeup. I love doing my makeup. I'm just going to take that and just kind of like tap it. Just starting right there like um, in the middle of my eye. And then just bringing it into that inner corner. Yeah, Judy, if you want to try, just send me a message. I love Unique. They have really good makeup and skincare. And tools. I like their brushes, too. Okay. I know. I never hardly ever wear my hair in a messy bun. Like, sometimes I'll just throw my hair on top of my head to, like, clean and stuff like that. But I don't never, like, leave like that. If I'm going to leave and not do my hair, I put it on like a baseball hat. Angela, so Unique doesn't really do like discount codes, but they do have sales. Like every month, they have a monthly special. Um, this month, the monthly special is lips. Anything to do with lips is on sale right now. See how my brow keeps like wanting to go down? It's making me really mad. Do some more of this. They could stick it on it. See if I can't get it to lift up. It's aggravating. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. Okay. Um. Oh, and then on, right on my lid where I put down that uh, lighter shade, I'm just going to go in with this stick eyeshadow from Unique. This is in the shade Gleaming. I don't know if they've restocked these or not, but these are my favorite, favorite, favorite things ever. I really love, like, these are so easy. They're basically like an eyeshadow crayon is like the only way I can describe it, but they're so pigmented and they stay on really good. I love using them as like a pop on my lid. Oh, Laura. Okay, yeah, Angela, that's no problem. No problem, girl. I'm going to be checking my messages when I get off of here. I have a try on haul that I need to do, but I don't know if it's going to get done today. My plan was to get on here and go live and then do the try on haul, but I'm literally starving. So, I don't think I'm going to be able to do that. And I need to warn Devin how hungry I am. Because when I <laughs> when I get done with this, I'm going to need him to be ready. Because I'm starving. Um, oh, one more thing. I just like to take this Wet n Wild Color Icon Multi Stick. And I love to put this right here. Just to kind of like brighten up my eyes and make them look more awake. There's like a little gnat in here that's driving me crazy. Summer. Will you go see what daddy's doing? Now I'm just going to take this pencil eyeliner from Unique in the shade Proper. This is like a really pretty chocolatey brown. And I'm going to tightline my eye. The movie um, that we're going to see starts at 8.45. But we've got to go eat before. Because I'm really hungry. So I'm going to need him to be ready to run. Is it raining? It sounds like it's raining again. So it was really dusty and dry here. And we kept like praying for rain, praying for rain, praying for rain. Because, um. Well, daddy's painting the hood of the truck. Is he? Yeah. Ask him, is he about ready to go? I tell him I'm about done, and I want to know if he's about ready to go get something to eat because I'm starving. Okay. Um, my bigger moonstone ring. This is from Lavender Blue, and I have a link and discount code in my bio for them. Have I tried the Loving Tan Maximum? Do you mean the Platinum? I have it, but I haven't tried it yet. 
I'm scared to try it. Because <laughs> the ultra dark is pretty dark. Yeah, he said he's almost done. Okay, good. Are you ready to go, Summer? Oh, uh, yeah. You have on what you want to wear and all that good stuff? Yeah. How'd you get the red lipstick off? And I think what I'm going to do on these, I think I'm going to cut them in half, but I think I'm going to use like this side, not this side for my half lash. Gracie, there is a spam account. Yeah, somebody's done made a fake account and has been trying to like read people's fortunes and stuff. I, I don't know. I don't know what's happening. It's so annoying. I think I'm going to open up a new mascara too. I think I'm done with that one. It's kind of dry. So we're going we're gonna to open up a new Quadra mascara. This right here is my favorite. There's nothing better than a new mascara. Like, seriously. Look at how shiny it is. <laughs> you didn't know they could microblade? Really? Yeah, everybody's talking about how good it is. I can't. So, honest review on the movie coming. Um, I had like a... I don't know if that was an eyebrow or an eyelash that had came out. Let's go ahead and... Oop, I got like a little... Crusty, rusty, hanging out. Dang, y'all couldn't have told me. <laughs> y'all must not have saw it. Oh, thank you, Carol. Um, I am getting ready because me and Devin and Summer are going to go watch The Blind. I'm so excited. I've been wanting to see it. Yes, I loved my brows. Okay, so it hurt really bad when I got my brows microbladed, but I loved them when they were microbladed. It was so much easier. It took me like no time to do my makeup when my eyebrows were microbladed. Okay, I'm just going to go in with the new Quadra mascara from Unique. This is a primer, lash serum, fiber tubing mascara. It is phenomenal. It's got two... Um, it's got like two ends on the wand. One is like these hard bristles. And then the other side is like a fluffy bristle. It's so good, y'all. I promise you, if you have not tried this yet, you need to. My lashes have never looked better. The lash serum I was using before I started using this mascara, it was making my lashes grow, but it was just making them longer. This one is making them more full. Like, I can actually see my lashes when I don't have makeup on. And I've never been able to see my lashes when I didn't have makeup on. So, that's how I know that it really does work. And I'm obsessed. Don't forget to get the tops of your lashes. The top needs mascara too. Look at those. And it layers really well. Yeah, I'm thinking about doing just like a half lash. I haven't done that forever. Okay, so now I'm going in with the fluffier side. Look at those. Okay, I know I have mascara all right there. We're going to get all that off. Okay, 
Okay. And then what I've been doing, that looks really good just by itself. But what I've been doing is just taking some of the Epic 4D. This has got Y-shaped fibers, and I've just been kind of putting this in there too. And I think it's just because I really want more volume on the outside. So I've kind of just been like judging this up on the outside corner. Because my inside corner, I feel like, is really long. But the outside, I wish these were a little bit longer. But I think it's because my, my eyes are so round. And I'm wanting more of like that cat eye look. Excuse me while I get mascara all up in my hair. You love how De Devin participated in my most recent TikTok? Y'all, he's a mess. And he had those words down before I did. I could not figure out the words of that. I kept messing up. So Summer must get her TikTok and skills from her daddy. <laughs> Lindsay, I did the unique matte bronzer in the shade medium. And I always mix in highlighter in the shade bronzed so that I can get this glowy bronze look like this. Message me if you want the link. It's so good. The bronzer is actually on sale right now, too. Uh, hey, Lisa. Hey, Caitlin. Baby. Dark is your daddy in there? Summer. Yes, I think I am going to do the half lash. Just because I want a little bit more on the outside. Like right here, I feel like I have no lashes. So I just want to add a little bit of something right there. Devin, do you get it? Brown. I'm like starving. What you want? We're definitely gonna have to go eat before we go see that movie. What are you thinking? I'm thinking maybe like Damon's, get some grilled chicken. Cause we've done good today. I don't really want to mess it up. What are you thinking? Obviously, it's got to be somewhere in Jessup. Right here. There's that strand bistro right there by it, too. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. What do there you think? Are. What do you there. think would be better? There you are. I wish you could talk Dark into going with us. I'm not trying. Why don't he want to go? He's such a little turd. Guess that's what it is. You live on this stuff? Yeah. Well, that's done. Getting damn mascara everywhere. Thank you, Brittany. If you don't quit leaning down on my chair. Don't tell me, what, don't tell me my business. Damn, my back. What are, you, what are you doing? Did you take a shower? No. Baby. I don't need one. Please go bathe. Y'all, they said hey, Devin. They said hey and go take a bath because you stink. No, he actually really doesn't stink. I've never smelled Devin and he stunk, honestly. Devin's like one of those people that he can even like accidentally forget to put on deodorant and he still don't stink. It's the craziest thing. Me, I am not that way. 
Do I say baby funny? Okay, so we're gonna, I don't know, I don't remember the brand or anything of these, but we're gonna cut these in half and hopefully I have, like I haven't applied fake lashes in so long. Oh, I do have lash glue. Okay, here we go. All I know is that this says it's style 690, but I'm basically gonna take and just cut them like right there maybe. Like that. And let's see what this will look like. Cause I don't want like this huge side. I just want like a little baby lash. Let's make sure I get these even. So like right there maybe. I feel like I anytime I like trim lashes, I never cut them even. Okay, let's see. And y'all tell me what you think. It's just going to add a little bit of something. Like, don't that look so much better? Look at how much more volume and stuff that adds. I could use for them to be a little bit longer, though. Maybe I do need to use the other side. And, of course, now I've done cut it. Where's that side that I cut? Maybe I do need to use these. I do have another pair. Like right there. So. Those are almost too thick. So probably I'm gonna have to use these ones that I cut. I don't know. I don't know. If, I feel like these are not the right lashes to do this with. But I want something. Maybe I need to use a different pair. Let's see. I'm not going to cut these a little less. Let's see. Summer. Summer. Is that better? Or worse? I think that's better than the other ones. Summer. Summer? Yeah. Are you eating? Okay, I thought you were eating some. I was about to say, because we're about to go eat. Okay. I wish these weren't so, like, blunt. I feel like it's not going to work because these lashes in particular are too thick. So, I'm not going to do that. Because that's not going to look right. I wish I had some different lashes. But see, I don't ever buy lashes anymore. Because I don't I don't ever wear them. So, I'm going to get some different lashes. Maybe I'll get like actual half lashes from Ulta. When I go find me some different uh, brow products. But I'm going to throw these away. Because I'm going to end up not liking that. So, we'll try that again later with some different lashes. That aren't so like bold. That makes sense. Yeah, I don't. I just don't think mm -mm. they're just too. Those are too much for what I'm going for. So we'll try again some other time. Um, lips. Let's do a. Let's do a pretty lip. 
Brittany, I think I would like them better if they were like over my whole eye, but I can't do those just on the outside. They're too like thick. Okay, I'm going to do Lit Liner in the shade Patience from Unique. And I really like that overline right here. My stomach is making a lot of noises. I'm literally about to starve to death. Do you go bathe? Mm -hmm. What does she have? Please quit leaning on my chair. Yeah, draw me a drink. Quit leaning on my chair. <laughs> I feel like you're going to break it when you do that. Yeah, it looked like it was like all on the outside. I'm like super hangry right now. Um, Baby, will you make sure Charlotte's got food and water and put her up? Okay, and then I'm just going to top that lip combo with some of this clear gloss. I really need to get some more of this. I probably got one of these, like, around here somewhere. Um, so, my shirt is sold out that I have on. I was going to try to link it on um, my TikTok live because I had this link through TikTok shop, but it's sold out. So, I wasn't able to do that. Okay, and then I'm just going to take pressed powder foundation from Unique in the shade Chenille. And I'm just going to put a little bit of this on the outside of my, like, the outside perimeter of my face. And I'm thinking I'm going to have to go spray a little bit of dry shampoo in my hair. Because it's like, it's not greasy, but I feel like it's on, like I feel like it's got, it's heading there. But the weather here is really sucky. Like it's raining. And I feel like that's kind of playing a big part into my hair too. I feel like my hair's wanting to like go greasy and flat because the weather's so poopy. Which sucks, because I really wanted the weather to be nice for tomorrow. Because we're having Dirk's birthday party outside. And we wanted to have, like, a fire and all that. And now it's, like, rainy and wet. And we just had that tree removed. So, it's, like, <sighs> aggravating. Okay, but that is it. That is our makeup look. Um, that's what we're going to go with today. Let me know if you guys have any questions. Let me know if you guys want to be shade matched. Let me know if you want the link to the lip sale that's going on right now. Um, Summer. Yeah. I'll get her. Okay. Let me know if y'all want a husband or any children. Because <laughs> I have some that y'all going to have. What lipstick is that? Eight? Brittany, message me and I can send you the link. Thank you. What mascara did I use? I did the Unique Quadra Mascara and the Epic 4D. If you want to sell, Kathy, message me and I can give you more information and I can give you the link to join. I'll get her. I was going to get her. That way y'all weren't underneath me while I was trying to finish this. Yeah, because evidently you're her safe place. Huh? Evidently you're her safe place. <laughs> okay, y'all, but I'm going to go. Um, We're going to go watch this movie. But um, I'm going to be checking messages on the way there. So, let me know if you want to be shade match. Uh, let me go. Because Charlotte's about to pull all my stuff.